Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. You guys see from the thumbnail and from the title of today's video, we're going to talk about strategy items. I'm going to explain why they're important. I'm also going to explain how to get them. Are they worth it? Yes or no? So I'm going to do a full breakdown in this video. So with that being said, if you guys need any help or any other questions about anything in Ultimate Team, let me know down below. I can post a video on it or I can send you guys a direct message helping you guys out. And with that being said, right now we're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. So if you guys want to stay updated, only thing matter related, make sure you guys follow the channel. Don't forget to follow my socials. Don't forget to show this video some love. Let's jump into it. So jumping into it, the easiest way to explain it to you guys is by showing you guys. So I'm right now, I'm in the auction market. And this year, there are two ways to get boost on these team strategy items, right? There's ones for the theme team. So you guys see right here, we have common, aka silver, you know, collectibles that will give you a team boost depending which tier you guys have so we have one right there for the cowboys the seahawks so if you guys are trying to build a theme team you guys want those and you guys wanted the higher tier ones then we also have position you know team strategy items for boost right here is a running back for a con that is plus one trucking and obviously the better the tier the more expensive it's going to be but the benefits of the boost is way better and it's actually worth it to be honest with you guys so going from common we also have this green one which is uncommon and you guys see right here, you jump from team boost from one to three. It's pretty hard to see just because it's kind of me on the number, which hopefully they fix that. But if you guys are running a theme team, you guys want to get those. Right now, there's not a main theme team that's meta. So that might change within a week or so, or for sure within a month of the game. So just know there's two different boosts for positions and for theme teams. Not to mention there's different tiers. The highest tier is actually a purple one, which isn't on the market right now, which is actually right there. It's called Let It Rip. It's going for like 200k coins, but it's worth it. It's the highest tier. And you see this right here? It gives your quarterback and your own line a boost for throw power, impact blocking, and throw accuracy deep. So if you guys want to have the best ones, that is what you guys would want on offense right now. Just expect them to be adding a lot more or to upgrade them throughout the year. But for right now, that's what's on the auction market. The best one, the one that I actually want on my squad, I'm going to wait till it goes down in price. It is this corner and free safety one. It's plus three in zone coverage, plus three in play recognition, and plus one in press. So by far, that is the best one. Let's say that's too expensive for you guys. And just keep in mind that you guys could do the set, which I'll show you guys in a little bit. Or you guys can go on the auction market and buy it. I personally like the auction market one. I feel like it's better. I'd rather just get it outright. But if you guys have what it takes to do the set, why not? You guys also have the rare one, which is the second highest one. This one's for defensive linemen, for example. Gives them plus two power move, plus two finesse move, and plus one block shedding. Oh, just know that there's different tiers. One for position boost and one for theme team boost. And you guys could buy them on the auction market and could sell them. And jumping over to the sets, I'm not going to lie to you guys, thinking about it, if you guys have what it takes to do these, it wouldn't be a bad way of making up some coins. I remember last year, these rare, you know, team strategy items, they quick sold for 50k, and the fact that now you guys can sell them, you guys can probably make some more coins off of them. So let's, sort of, let's open up a rare strategy item just because I actually need it. You guys see right here, I already filled it out with a Steelers, you know, uncommon item, a Patriots, a Saints and a uncommon for a cornerback boost so overall let's open it up and see what we can get hopefully i don't know hopefully we get something good honestly let's trade in the falcons one just because i really don't need it and hopefully we get lucky hopefully we pull a let it rip one a purple one so let's open it up i don't know why it's up there it's still a glitch in ea as you guys see right there we're getting a really good one even though it's a rare one it's a wide receiver boost it's plus two catching traffic, plus two short route running, and plus one spectacular catch. So I guess at this point, you know, day two of the game official being out, I'll take it. Remember, after pulling it, you guys have to activate it. And for right now, you guys can't upgrade them. So that might be changing in the future as we're going further into the year, especially for Ultimate Team. But remember to go here for the strategy item tab. Remember to add it. Just like that, it will be activated for all the positions. So, for example, all the wide receivers will get the boost. And flat out, that is how you guys do it. So, if you guys are new to Ultimate Team and want to know what they're used for, now you guys know. And how to get them, now you guys know. Just remember to activate it in your lineup. So, 
So when you guys play your game, you guys have that boost. Just like that, you guys already know everything about team strategy items. If you guys have any questions, let me know down below. If you guys want to see a video or a breakdown of something else, leave a comment down below. For sure, be uploading it or I'll send you guys a direct message. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to stay updated, make sure you guys follow the channel. Don't forget to follow my socials. I'm going to get some love. I'll see you guys on the next one.